Good afternoon everyone. Hope you're all well out there. Um, I did some really interesting cutting earlier on today with uh, my Dan Arm 71 and also my uh, John Sear 525, so mid 80s saw. And it's just interesting running the 525 against the 71 Dan Arm and just looking at the power difference. And it reminded me that the, the 525s are running a, a 32mm stroke and a 44mm piston and they're a nominal 49cc and last week I've been looking for a, a vintage bar for one of my 08s's and so I've got a brand new 4 4 steel chain which I haven't used but I wanted to run it with one of the original early 60s solid nose bars and so I was very fortunate I managed to get a donor saw about a week or so ago and had a beautiful engine had a problem and um, but a beautiful vintage 17 inch guide bar stamped 1968 and so the 08 S's were from from 65 on and and the early ones were 32 mil stroke and 44 mil piston and they they call these a nominal 48 so I presume steel must round down and John Seard probably just rang the numbers up slightly um, but what's a revelation is how this thing cuts now it has um, a brand new steel chain on or how old is it a few months and uh, never haven't had to do the rakers or anything it's just not being used like that but uh, so I thought I'd show you how it runs with a freshly dressed bar. I've done the drive rails, or the guide rails, sorry. And I've got some 11 or 12 inch uh, solid hardwood. I thought I'd show you how she cuts because she's an absolute pleasure to use. Gorgeous starting engine. Um, and what else am I gonna say about this? It's interesting from, I didn't realize this either until I took one of the 08s, the original 08 apart, which was from 63, just a couple of years beforehand, is the same piston, 44 mil, but I didn't realize they were a different stroke. I had no idea, I don't know why they didn't realize that. So they're a 34 mil stroke, hence the, the additional displacement. So that's a 50 cc. And then when they went to the 08 S's, they dropped to a 48 cc. And then of course, if you had a, a later version, so I'm presuming this is the older one because of the, because of the moulding into the side cover. I think the later ones were an inset aluminium badge from 69 on. Um, apparently then they're 56 cc's, but the only way I guess you'd really know is by measuring the piston. So I'm unsure if this is a 48 or a 56, but I'd say it performs like a 56. Anyway, let me show you how she cuts. She's gorgeous. clear that is guys but she's uh <laughs> wow she's just amazing she cuts so cleanly um yeah she cuts so well so i thought it was interesting again 1960s obviously professional saw in its day 
and then the the 525 um, mid 80s I think 85 so some 20 years later I'm running a 325 pitch setup nowhere near as fast nice with the chain brake obviously lighter weight saw but just goes to show if you have a 08S with a um, a really nicely set up bar and chain, real great runners and um, oiler working well, just a beautiful saw to run. <laughs> Hey guys, thanks for watching. That's my gorgeous uh, steel 08S now now running a 1968 genuine solid nose steel guide bar with a new steel chain and cutting like a devil. So I think what I'll do tomorrow, I will run it against my one of my Sax Dolmar 112s again about 20 years newer and that's um, 51 cc's and got a brand new bar and chain set up nearly on the da on the on the Dolmar 112 so I'll do a head to head now I know this one annihilates the 525 thanks for watching guys new video soon stay safe bye for now